Fall back again just a few minutes later. Now we're going to change that cute puppy picture into a bitmap. What that's going to do is a lot of our images are going to have white around them. In my case, it doesn't matter because I have a white background. But if my background was red, it might make a bit, it might make a little bit of difference. Here it doesn't make that big a difference. Let me get a picture real quick of a bicycle and I'll show you what I mean real quick. So I'm going to just go, uh, I just got to get the right, okay, we're going to do bike. And I'm going to go look in her images. And I'm going to use this sweet bike right, where is the one that I like to use? There, that's a Walmart bike. That's quality. We're going to copy that, copy. And then I'm going to go, I'm going to paste this in here. Edit, paste. There's my quality bike from Walmart. All right, so. Now, do you see the white around the bike? And if I had a background that was red, it does not look very cool. That looks ugly. I would not want that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this into a bitmap map. It's going to be black, and it's going to look really cool. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go to Path. My bike is highlighted. We're going to go to Path, and we're going to go Trace Bitmap. Now, let's just look at this real quick. Threshold. This is what is going to tell us how much of the lines it's going to grab. I am going to leave it at 0.45 and see what happens. This is a lot of trial and error. So I'm going to go OK. Now I'm going to grab my arrow here and move it. And you can see it came out pretty nice. Now if I want less of the image, I can lower my threshold. Click on it, go OK, OK, and we're going to get a little bit less or more detail. So you play with that. I have seen some pictures needed to be less threshold to make it work, and I've seen some that had to go way up here to get more lines. So you have to play with that. Just keep selecting your picture, hitting OK, and let's see what, um, see now there. I got a lot of the spokes. I got some of the spokes. By going up, it took more of it. And I like that picture the best. Once I get the right picture, I can delete. If I had my picture white and the background black, I would try inverting the image right there. And then you actually go down with your threshold. Try that if you have a background that is black and your picture is white. All right. So that is kind of cool. A cool way of adding a... Whoops, adding a logo that you might want. All right, there you go.